shit to you, yeah And you knew I was gon' get this shit to you, so baby, yeah G4 pilot, flying private in the lair I've been on the island, shorty wildin' over here Gonna sit your pretty ass down in a chair Cause you know how to stare Cause shorty got ass on, what the fuck? Hey guys, so I'm back with a, another wig review And this wig was sent to me from Wild African Hair I know some of you guys may be familiar with Wow African, um, but their company is amazing. So if you're not familiar with them, go check them out. I'll leave their links in the description box. They have really high quality, nice wigs. They are a little on the pricey side. So um, if you don't like spending a lot of money on a wig, um, I wouldn't suggest that you even go on their site because... Um, I don't, to me personally, I don't feel like their wigs are very affordable. They are a little bit on the pricey side. So, um, enough about that. Let me just show you the packaging and everything. And I will mostly for this video just be inserting clips, um, of this hair. But I am going to tell you what it is. This hair did not come like this, you guys. I did do this myself. And I don't have like a full on tutorial, but I do show you the process of what I do. This was all like through trial and error. I didn't really know what I was doing. I do plan on doing this look again, and I will do a tutorial on it when I do it. And the colors will be more in sync. I just like this. I still like it, trust and believe. I do like the way it turned out, but I just wish my color coordination was a little bit more put together. Um, so yeah, but the quality of this hair besides the color and everything and how this hair looks the construction the quality is amazing is definitely worth the price so if you do like spending a little bit of coins on your hair um definitely check out wild african because their hair is amazing it's you can tell like it's such good quality um it took to bleach very well and didn't damage the hair whatsoever. The hair, after I bleached it, it's like it never was bleached. That's how good this hair is, you guys. So this is the packaging. And what I have in my hair is their 360, um, 360 wig. Uh, it's basically like your 360 closure. And then, you know, you have like the wefted the wefted hair in the middle. Um, I do think I have some clips so I can just show you the construction of the wig and stuff like that. Also, I think this is um, Brazilian version, Brazilian hair, I do believe. But everything will be in my description box just in case I'm wrong or I'll leave it on the screen. The one thing that is not really bad, but um, this wig does have a lot of flyaways and I had to take my... Uh, got to be glued the hairspray like the holding spray and I just sprayed it on my hands and rubbed my hands together and I just like slicked down the flyaways and I also went in with my wand curler and just put some heat over it so it can like stay and that helped this wig out a lot this is all the hair is on the thin side but I think they do offer this wig in 180% density 180% density yeah so, yeah, if you wanted your wig thicker, they do offer it to be thicker. But I feel like this density is definitely good for if you want to wear your hair straight, if you love wearing your hair straight. Because if you wanted to curl this and you wanted those big, like, nice curls and it to be full, you're not going to get this from this wig because it's just not enough hair for that. Unless you want to go in and add your own tracks to it, but I wouldn't do that. I would just go up and... The density, like I said, they do offer 180% density, but I have no intention, no intentions on curling this hair. It definitely looks really nice, sleek, and straight, and I definitely love wearing it behind my ears. So, yes, this wig is cute, and this lighting is not giving this color any justice because to me, it's just looking like this is green and red. And that's actually not even red. It's pink, but it's coming off that color. So I'll insert um, clips of what the color really looks like so you just can see the goodness of this color. Oh, of these colors. And I'll insert pictures of the hairline and all of that good stuff. So.
So basically this is just the construction of the wig and it's three combs in the front, one comb in the back with adjustable straps and it's just your 360 construction. Okay guys, so basically you can go to your local beauty supply store or anywhere that sells, you know, hair products. And basically I just got the Claro Professional um, BW2. This is the bleach packets and they run you about like three dollars so i got three of these i really don't know how many i'm going to use but i just got three just in case i probably don't need all three but yeah i got me some gloves i got my mixing bowl i have 40 volume developer because i want the hair to lighten really fast and bright and then these are the colors that i will be using baby blue violet gem electric lime and neon pink so yeah um never did this before i'm about to see how it turns out i have okay so now i'm just adding my bleach powder into my uh, mixing bowl and i used two packs of this because i didn't bleach the whole head i just took pieces basically and just chose where i wanted the you know bleach to be um so yeah, that's basically what I'm doing, and I'm just uh, adding a 40 volume developer, 40 vol. did I say volume? I don't know what I said, but I'm adding a developer, and then, yeah, I'm just mixing, mixing, mixing away. Um, mine's was like a creamy consistency. It wasn't too watery, but it wasn't thick at all. It was just like in the middle. So, yeah, I'm just mixing. Make sure you mix this really, really good, and just keep on mixing away. So now I'm using this aluminum foil and I just cut up pieces or rip pieces. Um, basically this is just to make the hair change faster and then I felt like it was just better because I was doing it in sections. So for me this just works, it worked better for me. You don't have to do this but I just chose to do this and that's basically what I did to all the hair in the front. I just picked pieces, I didn't do any hair in the back. And now this is how light it got the hair and I left the bleach on for maybe like 15 minutes. So this is after I added the color and like I said, it turned out really bright and vibrant and I really love the results and I love this hair. Like I said, the hair was not damaged um, at all. I know all. this hair is not for everybody. So um, if you don't like the colors and everything, it's cool. You don't have to like it. Um, my style is not everybody's style. Um, but yeah, if you don't like this color, just look past the color and look at the wig itself, which is beautiful. The hair is beautiful. Um, this is proof that the hair colors beautifully. Um, it's not damaged at all. Yeah, but y'all know I love my colored hair. I'm just that type of person who just likes to try different things and step outside the box and... You know, I just like to try different things, you guys. And this was definitely fun for me. So, yes, that's it for this video, you guys. Because I'm just talking way too much. Oh, yeah. You was who I was gonna bring all this shit to, yeah. And you knew I was gonna get this shit to you, so baby, yeah. G4, pilot, flying, private, in a layer. I've been on